the shooting stance is exactly the same whether I'm by myself shooting a rifle or whether I'm behind the shield. You guys ready to shoot? Okay. Yeah. No problem. We'll see it. Yep. For the past week, uh, the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office SWAT team has been working with the Haitian National Police conducting ballistic shield training. There's 11 that are currently in the program this past week. Uh, their narcotics division and their SWAT team. We spent two days inside of our shoot house showing them different tactics. Let's go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> with room clearing, passing doors, passing rooms, um, entering into rooms, encountering subjects inside of the rooms, and how to, to deal with them uh, through ways that we have learned over the years with training with the shields. I'm moving my body around the weapon, so pretend the weapon's on a stand here. Uh, we spent an entire day on the firearms range, showing them different techniques, um, shooting one-handed behind the shield and the difficulties with that. Whether at the five yards or 300 okay. yards, it's a very short distance from high know. and low. And then we introduced a, um, a patrol rifle into the, the firing portion as well, where it showed them the difficulties of, of making sure that the shield operator is safe as well as the person that's covering them with the rifle. We built it on a 40 hour, approximately eight hour per day program. And at, at that eight hour marker per day, they wanted to keep going. It's been, it's been very positive feedback so far. We already have an idea about the shield. Since we come, I think uh, our knowledge is coming more and more because we got some new techniques that is really important to use the shield. So I can say, in other words, it's really benefit for, for us to come here and to get that training. Show your hands. hands! Show your hands! Have a say. Excellent. So at the driving range, we conducted um, vehicle um, operations where they may encounter um, a barricaded subject in a vehicle, as well as uh, if they had to encounter rescuing an injured officer or civilian, and how to utilize the ballistic shields to recover that person, minimizing injury to themselves. Today, the officers had an opportunity to demonstrate what they, they've learned. They did teach backs for the, the instructors here to, to show off their knowledge and their skills. And they'll be participating in a graduation, and tomorrow they will head back to Haiti. In the name of the entire team, and in the name of the Haitian National Police, he wants to tell you that you have a professional team. They were very impressed by the way that they administered the training. How come everybody's coming here? <laughs> Any idea? App apparently we're getting a quite a good reputation for uh, our training program. The Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office has such a wide variety and, and subject matter experts in, in different programs. And it's been a, a huge success this week. Uh, a lot of great feedback and a really great group of guys that we've been working with.